All right, ladies and gentlemen, as we look at section 4.1, the very first uh, problem that we're given is really not a work it out type problem. We are given an example of a polynomial function, okay? And the first thing they want me to do is to classify this function by name. Whether it's a constant, a linear, a quadratic, a cubic, or a quartic. Now, first thing we need to do, this term has degree 2, this term has degree 1, this is a constant term, which means it's degree 0, by the way. This is degree 3, and this is degree 4, you know, per term. Now, remember, the one, the, the degree of the polynomial is not found by adding these up, it's found by using the highest one. So the degree of this polynomial is degree 4. That's the highest exponent we see. And when you have a fourth degree polynomial, it is referred to as quartic. Okay, they want the leading term and then they want the leading coefficient. Now, this is not in the correct order, but the leading term is the one with the highest power. So the leading term would be 0.5x to the fourth. And if that had been a minus, we would have carried the minus with it. Okay? So our leading term is not only the coefficient, but it's also the variable to raised to the power. My final question asks what the leading coefficient is. Well, you look at the leading term and you only take the coefficient, which means you take the real number in front of the variable expression. So in this case, the leading coefficient is a 0.5. So what I want you to be catching, the leading term involves the letters. The leading coefficient only involves the number that is truly with the leading, with the leading term, but it's not the x part of it or the variable part of it. Okay, so that's the difference between this part and this part. So this is a pretty short video. It's just a nice way to get started with 4.1 and to just remember some terminology. Remember, a constant function would just be a number, like f of x equals 4, okay? And by the way, its degree is 0. A linear function, you know, anything y equals mx plus b has degree 1. Quadratic is degree, 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 let's try that again, John, degree 2. Cubic is degree 3. Quartic is degree 4 and anything beyond degree 4 is just called a higher order polynomial. And we are done.